A serious scrutiny of onions is being done before settling for the best quality in tandem with consumer needs. For 52-year-old Tonile Banda, a trader from Lusaka Centenary Township, her focus is on the smaller sizes of onions because most consumers in the area don't have storage facilities. Our customers prefer smaller onions to big ones because some don't have fridges to store the remainders. Levison Koma, an onion farmer from City District, is cashing in from some millet from the 1,000 bags he has brought to Ntendere. For him, the smaller onions are selling like hotcakes for obvious reasons. Small sizes, they are the ones that are on demand. Yes, bigger sizes, they go slow. It's because you find that in one party, uh, there are more than bigger ones. So for the marketeers to sell, it becomes difficult. Eh? For the big ones, but for the small ones, they make profit, more profit. However, the continued importation of onions has had a negative impact on its pricing. Since the prices also are down because of the supply from these other countries outside, like South Africa, we found it difficult. So we are just giving it out at a giveaway price. Levison's concerns are backed by Zambia National Farmers Union, ZNFU President Javi Zimba's lamentations. That continued importation of onions despite high local production will see about 23 million kwacha worth of the produce going to waste. But Minister of Agriculture Permanent Secretary Green Bozi has charged that ZNFU members currently only have larger onions which are not on demand and chain stores turning to imports. Mr. Bozi has however reviewed that government has temporarily suspended issuance of import permits for onions but has turned to the discussion table with ZNFU. So we want the data uh, on what, you, what is currently available on the types of onions, what quantities, and then what is the national consumption for the onions. Brian Moale, ZNBC News, Lusaka. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.